Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some cereal. This is made by Quaker Oats, so the Quaker Oat Company. It's called Quisp. It is crunchy corn cereal. And uh, the reason I bought this, I paid a lot of money for it. Um, it's a small box. It's only 8.5 ounces, 240 grams. Uh, someone named Dennis, he asked me if I had ever tried Quisp, ever heard of Quisp, and I, I said, I've never heard of it, and you've never heard of it either, have Not you? Not that I remember. No, uh, because he, then Dennis, he, I said, I've never even heard of it, and he said, I wonder if Kevin remembers it from his childhood. I mean, the box looks vaguely familiar, but I mean, you're talking about, could be a cartoon character from yours. I don't, I don't, no, I don't, I don't definitely remember. So, I found this on Amazon, um, I paid $9.50 for it. It was free shipping with Amazon Prime, but... Yes, I paid a lot for it, nine fifty. But I, the reason I did it is because I thought, you know, it's out now, and if I don't get it now, I might never have the opportunity to try. It. So, did, but did it go away? And well, and something on the side of the box okay. indicates that to me too. Okay. It says, "Hey, Quisp, where have you been?" I was on Planet Q gathering the necessary supplies of Quisp cereal for consumption on Earth. Is it true you're back to stay? Only if Earthlings want me to. In fact, it's getting tough to find a place to park space haulers carrying such vast quantities of Quisp cereal. How do I get Quisp? Now Quisp is available to all who desire it on this planet. For more information, please visit www.quakeroats.com. So, so yeah, it sounds like they went away for a while. And now, now they're coming back. there are so many cereals. I think oh, yeah. they are probably having a very hard time competing with all the other cereals yeah. on the market. So that's what I think. That's a cute little character. So that's why. Yes, I paid nine fifty for it. I hope it's good. <laughs> um, it's just crunchy corn cereal. Um, it's uh, one and a fourth cup. Forty three grams is one hundred and seventy calories. There are not many ingredients. I'll okay. have a picture at the end um, so that you can uh, see the nutritional information. They look ingredients. like little corn pops. Like pop, little glory pop cereal. Mm. Those are good kids would like to eat those just dry. I swear I had these as a kid. Well, like I said, the corn pops. Taste like those. Taste a lot just like those. The pop cereal. You still in the day had a corn, a piece of corn. <laughs> I remember, remember this flavor. Remember he was flavor. in a Western outfit. I remember this flavor. So I don't think I, I don't. I'm, I mean, I may have had those. I don't know. Who knows? Well, um, when you get older, your memories. I know quite my. Well. I know my parents would not have bought this. I know they would not. I see, have. my parents might have bought that. Mine wouldn't have at all. But I did go when I was very, very young. I did go to a daycare. Yeah. And I'm talking when I was like three or four years old. And so you never know, I could have absolutely had it there. Mm. I've had that flavor before. I think they're good. I, like I do too. Like I said, I think little kids would love running around with these just eating them dry. Yeah. I've, and they're sweet. They're mm -hmm. very, very sweet. And um, so you don't need to add any sugar. Good crunchy. I like those. Those are good. I wonder if old time cereals like this have had to change their recipe to add whatever it is that mm -hmm. they have in there these days to make it stay crispy. I don't know. You know? Like coating on something. Yeah. Like they, because you know that they have improved on that. Yeah. And uh, so I wonder if classic cereals like Cheerios that has been around forever and ever. Have they had to I'm sure they've coated update? I really like this. Non-nutritive uh, food varnish. That's what it is. The Christmas story, sorry. I mean Christmas vacation. Um, Clark. Clark. Uh, I like them. I think they're good. I do too. I think I it's mean, delicious. I would spend nine dollars for them. But no, but, but if you can find them in your store, yeah, try if them you out. can find them in the store, yes, absolutely, trauma. I think I think they're very, very good. Yeah. 
I would just assume eat these as um, as, anything as anything else. No. Yes, because they're they're that sweet. Well, if they're if they're worried about them staying around and people buying them though, they need to get them out to more stores because we've never seen them around here. No, not at all. And the little guy's cute. Mm -hmm. and, he looks like a, an '80s cartoon character. Oh, you think so? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, th I think he's a cute little guy. I was thinking more '70s. Might even be '70s. Yeah, the the basic primary kind of colors yeah colors and yeah stuff. I would, looks like color forms yeah so i have yeah it does look like color forms I, I have no idea how long this cereal has been around so if you all have tried quisp let us know in the comments if you have this in your stores take a look around see if you have it in your store comment below and let me know if any of your stores sell this the store in the area yeah in your area because i had to find it on amazon and so I would be very curious to know, like, okay, if you go to Maine, or am I going to find this in a grocery store? Or if you go to Washington or Texas, you know, let us know because I'm, I'm very, very curious if anybody has this at all or are you having to go to Amazon to get it? So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.